us because uh, doing warm ups usually I'm super like pumped and ready and I think it transforms in the game when I'm like jumping too high on a jump shot or something I'm not really focused. So today I just kept my mind right and stuff and I took you know calm, smooth like game like shots doing the warm ups and, uh, and whatnot. And I thought it helped transfer it over to the game. Um, in terms of the way coaches coaching the team, it looked like you took a little different approach. Yeah, Sitting guys down one, yeah, one, one, one being a little calmer, it seemed like tonight. Well, we're about to go on a trip, you know, have three games, and uh, we're definitely using both these games as like a learning point for our team. You know, we're trying to become a better team. Uh, we're obviously we were four and four before the last two games, and uh, we looked at that as that as like you know not being good enough. So we had to look at these two games and take them like we did and win by 20 and hope the other teams under 50. And uh, the freshmen, they're obviously playing much better, so they're going to play more time. So there's going to be different lineups, and he used this a little bit of time today to try to do some new lineups and teach the freshmen and teach us how to play. Last couple games, you struggled offensively. What was different about tonight? Just a couple more questions, guys. Tonight, but... Well, I mean, I got a little bit more shots, too. Um, <laughs> it's funny, you know, I just. Uh, I got a few more shots. My teammates found me in good spots where I'm comfortable. I was uh, at the top. I got the ball at the top, the key a bunch, and I have a bunch of space where I can choose to go left or right. And I think that was the difference. I wasn't clogged up in the hole like I usually am, or like I usually was in the last few games. Uh, Coach Brownell talks about you know earning minutes on the defensive end. Do you think playing better on the defensive end? Oh yeah, by all means. If you, I mean, it, you can just watch the game. If you play by it on defense, one play you're coming out. So uh, you definitely better get down and slide. Even myself, I. I uh, remember everybody probably remember why I tried to block the guy with my back because he jumped because uh, he got past me. Coach, you know, coach was about to take me out, but thank God it was time out. He talked to me, coached me up, and let me go back out there, and I did a better job with it. You and Devin have to have more games like this together where you're both scoring and, and being consistent forces inside with three guys. Oh, yeah, obviously, you, uh, you always want an inside threat, and me, him, and Bobo, we got to do a bunch of inside scoring, and especially when me and Dev are out there scoring, you know, we're getting. 12 and 15 each and stuff. It should be hard for teams to beat us because uh, although you know Andre didn't have a night that he wanted to, that those are rare for him. Like he's always, I mean, he's going to knock down two or three threes always every game and stuff. Okay, and last we question. See that is going to hit some points, so we're always going to win uh, by big if we do that. Just your motivation coming off the bench tonight. Last couple games. Now, um, me coming off the bench was only due to being sick, so it wasn't like no motivation. I I understand. I was just sick, so I was out, so I missed a little bit of scouting the previous game against Winthrop, and, uh, and it was only a day scouting, so there was no way I could make it back in the starting lineup. So I just took it as like going when I went out there playing like a starter. It's kind of good, you know. It's like a, bringing another starter off the bench, so, and I thought it worked out pretty well.